This is my yard now. It's me here, your Martin Ryan Emperor here. I was thinking to do a video doing my reaction of Roman Reigns updated on the WWE Network. Um, I'm not going to show it you guys uh, to this video. Uh, I'll get blocked, but I'll probably show you my reaction of what I think. Um, Roman Reigns, when he did come back at Monday Night Raw, um, it's in the backstage and what he thinks about it. But here we go. One, two, three. Yeah, I mean, I definitely... Definitely thought about... The emotions of it all. Not gonna cry. Not gonna cry. You know that. I almost did a little bit on the last one. <laughs> This one's all good though, which I think it, it might get me, it might get me, but. No, I, I had to just ask myself if I really wanted to share this news, but I didn't want people to think that this defeated me. There's a different part of me that's saying that you have more of a purpose than just being a wrestler. You have more of a purpose than just going in there and, you know what I mean, having that character of, Roman Reigns, there's so much more to me, and I feel so like I can truly more, connect with I people, see. not only connect with them, but give them hope, you know, I can be a beacon of light for people who are in the thick of it and are truly in the big fight. Exactly. I had to tell myself, it's not done yet, like, there's still so much more to do, you, you have a new purpose to go out there and show them that it is possible. Exactly, you're the beacon of hope, and you're my angel. And you are my, literally, one of the doubts of one of the best celebrities and actors. From the February 22 to, to, to 2019 to... Nah. Women range when a universal Trump... Frizzing. Was that a lot of the... I believe it was either a Saturday or a Sunday, and um, I just remember the doctor, one of our doctors telling me that something was going on with my blood, my blood tests, and they wanted to do another one because they thought something was off. So I went in and did another one, and then I remember going to TV on Monday, and I, I remember one of the refs coming up to me, and usually they'll be like, uh, you need an ATR, Mark wants to see you, and I'm like, ah, yeah, whatever, I'll be there when I get there. Uh, but this time you're like, hey, Dr. Amen, you know, the medical staff want to see you. And so I knew that something was up. Like, yeah. But I still in my head didn't truly believe it. Like, it was just like, ah, oh, something weird. You'll be fine. Blah, blah, blah. Mm. But when I got there, I could tell, like, the whole crew was in there. And they broke the news that, you know, my white blood cell count was obviously elevated. Oh, shit. We could sorry. point fingers in certain directions but with my history they kind of already knew what was going on kind of the quickest thing that hit me was the fact that i'd have to drop the title it sucked man it uh because i put a lot of time into it I, I chased it for for quite a bit and, and i i chase what that title means for my whole career you know to to reach the the highest point of our business to uh to be the highest you know the biggest I'm champion crying, that we have and then to have to lay it down i'm not crying for you guys because it drove me nuts i'm i'm trying to keep strong i'm trying to keep strong for you guys you you think like i'm gonna walk down this ramp again like you know what i mean next monday on friday that's what i was thinking. i'm gonna get to do this again but that was a very distinct feeling that was a very distinct moment i just I felt like what... One of the scariest parts If I didn't absorb me, every reaction that I got that night, that's one of my scariest thoughts. 
I was just scared. I was yeah. just, uh, I was just worried that the world wasn't going to take to this news properly. My real name is Joe. I remember this. And I've been living with leukemia for 11 years. I remember this. And My unfortunately, day. it's back. And because the leukemia is back, I cannot fulfill my role. I can't be that fighting champion. And I'm going to have to relinquish the Universal Championship. But I want to make one thing clear. By no means is this a retirement speech. Because I will beat this and I will be back. So you will see me very, very soon. I remember I I was done my reaction, I cried, and I cried, and I cried. I remember when I done my reaction to this. I remember when I done my reaction. I will, I will link it down below to the comments. I will link it down below. And I remember, I remember when I done my reaction. You know, there's certain things they train you for, and that was not one of them. But... At the same time, being scared walking down that ramp. I'm scared. To, Once I'm, I got I'm it off my chest, I'm like, oh, when, when you, felt free. When, you know what I mean? It was when like, he man, announced his leukemia, I was literally scared. I was literally scared. I was literally scared. We will lose him. I, I'm, I'm there for Roman. I'm there. I was crying my eyes out. Was I was literally um, bawling my eyes out. Judgment, you know. But I, I just have like to be strong and be I'm suffering from illness, you know, I, I've been very yeah, Roman. fortunate to be extremely healthy and take care of myself. You know, I put a lot of time uh, into my body and my health. During a make-a-wish, like if a child had leukemia, I would let them know, like, you know what I mean? I would tell them, you know, I don't really tell anybody this, but this is what has been going on with me. These are the, the troubles I've ran into, and I just want you to know that you're not alone, you know what I mean? And and the way it touched those families, the way, you know, it, the, the, the kid and the mom and the dad and the, the siblings would, what would doing react. Well. It was so powerful. But I wasn't sure that that would be everybody's reaction. I, I, I wasn't sure if everyone would take it that way. Mm. And I... I, I Being yeah, in places like this make you feel brand new. Again. <laughs> I get more nervous being in places like this than actually performing in front of like thousands of people. I, I get ner nervous a lot of times. I'm, I'm, I'm glad to watch this because I want to know the update. I haven't done anything as far as uh, like all these years when he announces leukemia until when he yeah, when he come back. And it's really it's really uh, interesting, guys. Go to the WWE so Network and subscribe to WWE Network and just watch watch how when Roman Reigns how he announces his leukemia on that time. And then when he come, uh, when he, it feels when like he a did long time. When you're sitting waiting to do activity, but these people are handling it really nicely for me, uh, and hopefully we'll get some good news that I can possibly get in that ring. In the meantime, I might just start working out. <laughs> yep. You know, I could have just stayed home and and soaked and just let it, you know, play out the way it did, but. I still have goals in life, you know, I still have a lot of things that I want to do, um, so I'm not going to stop, you know, if, if the goals. doctors say I'm able to do something, then I'm going to do it, exactly. for the first couple of months I was on, on my couch, couldn't even really move, you know what I mean, um, just seeing my kids running around me, my wife, you know, having to take care of everything, I just felt like immobilized. I felt like I couldn't you do anything. You knew I got a lot of respect for Once that kind of subsided and, and I started to get my feet back on him, my heart, I, I immediately as a wanted to start working out. I'm so watching I just wanted him, to continue to progress. And what he's saying, the moment, like, every single one he says, open, I, kick it open and just start, I always you know, respect. Running around in that room. So I love it's, uh, it's to been listen a, to him. It's a situation that's not ideal by any means, but when is it ever? It's really touching me. It feels really touch. To me, it, it, as a human being. Bad news is, you gotta go take some bumps now. Okay. 
just before, like, he, he, he practices in his ring going. to come back. And it's, Still going. it's such an interesting. Bumps suck, but just the idea of them and getting back up is nice. I thought, like, for the first time, I'd be like, oh, <laughs> ah, I can't get up. But it didn't happen. Pop right back up. That was a that was a three bump comeback right there. <laughs> you have to get me a get a cover on the fourth one at least. Yeah, fuck you. It's weird. I don't really even get nervous anymore. But for this one, it's it's already mounted up in the past like three or four days. You know, from when I talked to Vince and like when we started really hashing out this plan of you know getting me back and. Getting me back in, you know, into the groove of things, it uh, it didn't feel real until kind of within the past few days being here at the performance center, and then you know just my last couple of days at home. I just wanted to be good. I'm glad you're good. <sighs> you know, I always have respect for the guy. The yeah. Like, yeah, I got respect for the character, but more than that, I respect for the guy, what he's done, and trying to be formed for us, and how he works tensely every single week, and that's the guy I respect, Joseph, leader Joseph, I don't know why, because that's the guy I always respected for the bottom of my heart. See what I'm talking about? Everybody was supporting me. I have CML. Um, it's the chronic phase of leukemia. It's the earlier stages, so it's it's pretty much where you want to catch this disease, um, this illness. And pretty much for me, uh, there's a pill that they make. They make an oral chemotherapy, and it's there's a few different types now. When I first started, there was just one, and it's 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 not like taking Advil. Um, it's nothing like taking you know radiation and true chemotherapy, but it does have its side effects and it does have its its nastiness about it. But um, at the end of the day, if you're lucky enough to just take a pill, I think, you know, you're ahead of the game. You know, people say it all the time. Why, why don't we have any breakthroughs? Why, why aren't there any medications? Why don't we have any cures? Well, we do. We do. I mean, it's we're just not talking about it as much. We're, we're not celebrating the wins in this process. And right now, an oral chemotherapy is a huge win for people. And I'm one of them, you know. Exactly. It's allowed me to maintain a certain level of health. It's allowed me to, you know, stay out of pain. Um, you know, there are some side effects. For me, the, the main thing was arthritis. You know what I mean? It, it started in my feet and went all the way up to my hips. Um, That's bad. But, I, you know, I'll take a little bit of arthritis over, you know, going through radiation every day. But you keep fighting big dog. Not just in professional wrestling, outside professional wrestling, like out, like literally outside of, of the arena and outside of back, backstage and outside in, in the real world. And I will literally have to say, in the real world, the, him in real life, I respect. What he does yeah, in that season. arena, outside that arena, well, we have to do stuff like and this. I was, and I would say I got. If women remains watching this and I do my reaction, you know I have a, a truly thing. respect for me, and I got a lot of feelings and a lot of hearts and a lot of feelings to respect him and 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 always family and his kids because he's he's a hard worker, and I got look, got rich, I got a lot of respect for him as a human being. So, we're going to Georgia Tech. We're going to go out to the stadium. We got uh, the uh, athletic weight room is like, under the you stadium. You know, every week so. and every day, I always support Roman. I mean, I mean, always. Like to come down there always. Out, Not out, just the character, just the guy, guy I think we be supporting. When he has, when he when he had leukemia, till 
he's broke and now he, now he's been speaking and now he's back and I'm watching this do my reaction to you guys and I'm thinking okay do my reaction spent some time and spilled some blood on that field to, to love that school, but, uh, but yeah, I mean, that's where I met my wife, it's a whole bunch of really good memories, that's kind of why I I think they should have, and they should do a DVD of Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns' life, and Roman Reigns, and how, how, how he talks, and how he explains how the past and the present, they should do, they should do a DVD of this, and I will get it, and I will buy his DVD. It's like brand new. Like no joke. I I would literally buy Roman Reigns' DVD. A lot of different buy, uh, emotions. What everything about this guy? I will buy like this DVD. You know, the past. What's going on with me right now? The future. I learned a lot on this video. I said, I said, no, I said, no, People really think I'm tough. Enough. People say I'm tough. I think a lot of it was learned on this field. My time spent here at Tech. I wish sometimes, you know, I, I never had to even, I could just be normal, you know, regular. I hate it when, you know, I love it. I hate it when people, you know, how are you? How you doing? You feeling okay? You know, I, I've always been someone who wanted to convey strength, and when people are worried for me, I, it makes me feel not like I want to. Mm. But that's a part where I have to humble myself and just know everybody's out, you know, for the positive, and everybody's trying to just show in love, you know, and, and that's the awesome thing, you know. I, I've you know, I I've almost built this defense mechanism, and built walls up to protect myself, and. Somehow, some way, they got stripped down. So. That's true. But it feels good to be out here. It feels That's good true. every day that I wake up. I've said that for a long time, and I'll keep saying it. As long as God wakes me up, I feel like I can handle the rest. Mm. I didn't think I would be able to come back this quick, let alone if I was ever going to come back. You know what I mean? Just because I'm not 22. You know, I'm 33 years old now. I have three children. Um, three beautiful children, I respect and that. And being completely healthy living this life is, is hard enough, let mm -hmm. alone, you know, going through the measures that I'm going to have to go through now. Yeah. I feel good. Like, I feel energized. I don't feel tired, you know what I mean? Like, there'd be, there'd be days, you know, all the way from before I relinquished the title to, like, two months after, mm -hmm. where I'd just wake up and be tired. But just out of nowhere, within a couple of weeks... My energy changed, and I just knew it's working. It, it's actually working. The way I feel right now is how humans should feel. This is how I should feel, and I know it. It's funny, for like a few months, I just, I would cut this promo on my head, like, thousands of times, and it was, like, really good, too. And, and for the, like, past two days, I had kind of a block a little bit. I just keep telling myself, it'll come to you when you get out there, so, I hope it does. I got, I, I, no doubt, I always respected them. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I am literally going to cry right now. I, I uh, have... A deep time off respect for Roman. I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna cry. This is like a very touching for me, like how Roman, like how Roman's been through. This is a camera hug. This is what we do. Oh. This is called 
Yeah. Should I give him a kiss? No. No. Come on. Let me give him a kiss. Even as a 33 year old, I I still like to be around my friends. I still like the camaraderie. And I watch Ninja Vanish. The first time, like, it was just me and my mom. Like, the first time football was done with me. I knew it. Like, I knew they were done. Like, and that put the worst taste in my mouth, too. Like, because I put, like, a bunch of time into football. Like, since I was seven years old, and then out of nowhere, they're just like, done like, there's a whole bunch of other kids that are going to be able to play but not you you know what I mean and so I felt very isolated I felt like I was in a cave and it was just me and my mom and I, on an island you know what I mean we didn't know how to really get through this we just had each other I think this is very touching I think God I don't want to cry man <laughs> I saw a commercial on Nickelodeon this morning. Oh, yeah. That showed you trying to kill a little pig. No. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know anything. I am not going to cry. I am not that concerned. I know. Yeah. All right, love y'all. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. You'll find somewhere to just sit and start mulling over this thing. It's not very detailed at this point, which I'll, I'm sure I'll add on to it, but I don't think it has to be. I, I just, I think thank you is understated nowadays. I don't think there's enough thank yous in the world, but I still want it to be known that moments of being thankful, moments of, uh, you know, o overcoming adversity is still a huge thing in our society as well. Um, and I just want it to be known the gratitude I have for all my fans I just hope that people can take it as an inspiration and, and, and use it, you know. Now, my daughter didn't really get it. You know, she, she wasn't old enough to know about the first round. And once I got healthy, we just kind of didn't really dabble into it too much because I don't want her to worry about me. I don't want her to worry about herself. But I just had to reassure her that, you know, something very serious is going on. It's people aren't lying. People aren't just making this up. Um, but I'm going to be okay. And when she heard that from me, I think she knew, but I think her hearing it from me, you know, I got. I like when he says that. I got respect what he said. Last few weeks, I will, I will get, I will literally have to say, I know I had to stop that there because in my mind, my good old, uh, my good old friend, no, actually, scrap that. In in my mind, I when I was thinking, I said, "Oh, okay, Roman Reigns not going to be coming back. He's he he's never going to return again." But in my in my head, in, in my brain, I'm thinking, you know what? I need to keep strong and do it for Roman. I, like I don't need. Uh, yeah, I I was a little bit worried about him as a fan and as a human being, but on the other hand, I thought Roman, Roman, Roman Reigns will get through this and he will beat leukemia. And, and, he, and, and he did, and, and he literally did. And that's why, it's, it's, to me, it's a miracle. And it's like where I'm watching this right now on a WWE network I don't, when, yes, I was a bit worried, but I am in my head now, I need to cool down and don't be worried because when Reigns changed my life in the last few years, last few months now, um, and I'm, I'm, I'm watching where it's to me it whew, this is very touching for people who out there who has leukemia and I praise for them and I praise and every single day for them and then and and that's why I love doing these videos about Roman reigns not about the Roman reigns character the Roman reigns the guy beneath it all and then to explain how 
he is a fighter. And I think to myself, okay, he's a fighter. He can do this. He can work, like, he can beat leukemia. I don't need to worry. I don't need to panic. I need to think about my own life and think about my, um, in my mind. But it's extraordinary, really, because when Marines, what he says is extraordinary. Actually, extraordinary. And st let's, let, let's listen more, guys. I, um, she could trust the fact that I knew I was going to be okay. Oh. Are, they, are these the uh, the superstars here I'm calling for? <laughs> I'm doing a lot better. Thank you. Uh, you know, I, I'm going to be on Monday Night Raw tonight, and I'm going to make a pretty big announcement, but I just wanted to give you guys a heads up first, since we're all superstars here, and we're all in the, you know, we're all working together, <laughs> and let you guys know that I'm going to be able to come back to uh, wrestle pretty soon, and I'm in the first stages of remission, so it's all good news here. Congratulations. It hurts my heart a little bit to, you know, and it's one of those deals like, why me? Why, why, why am I good? And these these children aren't good yet. So it's it's tough. It's emotional. Yeah. But you know, I, I think and I hope that they can take my story and just use it as inspiration and know that day by day, if we just keep the faith, if we stay on track and stick That's to the drill, do my reactions um, and just, and just you know, write these positive vibes. That that hopefully, thing, you know, that everything will be all have. good in the future. So. I mean, I just, I can't even tell you, you've seen all the videos about all the kids, you know, and... I just focus on them. You did? Oh, that's awesome. Arcade and some Awesome. Yeah, you know, this, this, uh, you know, this second half right here, it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, I think so. 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 Yeah, all right, I'm gonna get ready for one. I, I, I feel... I'll, 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 you know what, I'll speak this later. I, I really need to... Oh, God, it's emotional. God, it's emotional. It's literally emotional for me. I feel my heart is like... Happiness so and excitement. Oh, my God. Might not be freaking out. I've always looked at every day as a blessing, but... It's amazing how it can, you know, elevate, how it can maximize even more so when you didn't even think it could, you know, so. It's cool to be here. It was, in a weird way, it makes me sad, but it makes me happy, too. You know, initially you think, like, man, this is what, I, this is what had to happen, you know, to, to reach some of these people. But at the same time, I'm just glad it reached some people. Like, if it reaches one child, you know what I mean? That one kid fighting for his life, you know what I mean? Going, going through all this different treatment, sitting in a bed by himself, and he can somehow, you know, use me as, as an image, you know, something, you know, to work towards, something to drive him, like the, the light at the end of the tunnel. If, if that one kid can say, if Roman can do it, I can do it. Then I think my job is done. You know what I mean? I, I think if if I can be a figure that you are makes figure, these children you are, you are or, or anybody, figure, anybody who's going everybody through everybody looks up to you, fight a little extra, wanna wanna live for an extra day, or you know, give them you know the strength to keep going, you know, to keep pushing through treatments and, and life. That I think, you know, that my story landed, you know what I mean? It, it did what it needed to do. Um, I, I still, feel, I'm oh not God. asking for something. I feel touching. You know I, what I mean? I, like, I honestly, I, if you want to boo me, boo me, man. Like, no, I'm going to cheer you, you for know, a moment. I, I just want to be out there. Um, Joseph, I don't need I'm, anything I'm extra. Here, I'm um, cheer for you, I don't you, need, I'm cheer for you. you know, anybody's sympathy. I just want to. I want to go out there and try to entertain you again. If I can do that you, you already for those kids me. and, and you already you know, those different people that are going way before in 2015, you already entertain me. If I can just help them 1%, like, even if it's the tiniest, just tiniest of reassurances, it's worth it.
I will never forget this. I'm not gonna lie, before my announcement in October, I was terrified, y'all. I was insecure, and I didn't really know if I wanted to share that secret with the world. I was scared to tell everybody because I didn't know how you would react. By the time I got home, the outreach, I mean, between people texting me, calling me, tweeting me, Instagramming me, Facebooking me, if there was a way to get to me, y'all figured out how to do it. It was very touching, it, and I will never forget the this amount moment. of thoughts, I will never forget the amount this. of blessings, the WWE amount of prayers Lord that you me. sent my way is completely overwhelming and God sent. Thank you so much. You so many people prayed for me. I did. God's I, I did every day. Full, you know what I mean? Every like it, single to day. the max. And I think I, I truly believe he was in his head thinking like, man. What is going on down there? What all for this one guy? All these people? That was the magnitude. That is how strong it was to be surrounded by y'all's love and y'all's grace. And to be able to feel that, the strength that you gave me. I can do anything like that. I can do anything with that type of strength and love. When I made my announcement, I said that I was going to swing for the fences. We did better than that, y'all. We didn't just swing for you the fences, man. Run. We hit a home run. I'm in remission, y'all. <laughs> I remember when I'd done my reaction to this, I was like literally the happiest man alive for Roman. I was happy for Roman. I, I, I was truly, am. Um, my heart was literally just... So before I go, I'm going to say it. Probably a whole bunch more times, but I'm going to say it one last time. Thank you so much, y'all. I never would have thought this many people would have been backing me up. I, I told my I mom. I always back you up. My mom was crying and just stood When I was worrying. in 2015, I backed I you up mom, years ago, we're man. We're not alone this time. Like, I'm with you till the end. I don't I'm feel with, like we need to be as worried as we were the first time. I'm with, I, I'm with Roman Reigns till the end. It was just like a huge smile. I don't know if I was actually smiling or not, but I just like I felt like I, I had like the, the earlobe to earlobe smile going, you know. But I just thought it was really good. But regardless, I hope they just know. I hope they can just feel my gratitude. And I feel gratitude. I, know I, said it a few I, times, I always give you just respect. Thankful is like the the best word I can come up with. using this stuff yet? <laughs> See, right now I'm hugging, the favorite is hugging his mother. He's and his sibling is pissed. She, she's running her mouth it's as I hug my mom. She so, she still has a, 33 child. years, 33 years, <laughs> 33, and she's stacked up as a teen either. It, it wasn't even, you know what I mean? I didn't tell her to be the black sheep. Every no, every it's, going right here, yeah. it's right here, yeah. It's right here, yeah. Uh, I feel the love. I, I literally just throw it at, like just everything he said is very touching. Very and it's What? Oh my god, that is. I need to have a haircut done. Wow. I I felt. Oh my god, I'm. I'm not gonna cry or. That that. I can't. Phantom how. He. He's been gone through when he when he dropped the title and he had when he has leukemia and then oh god I I feel where 
our our prayers and hopes for people like the kids, the people, um that when what Roman Wayne's gone through when he has leukemia, I will, I will literally pray to the kids and people who has what Roman Reigns had. My, my story is... Let, 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 let's talk about my story. When I was watched the WWE, I didn't even know about Roman that much. I didn't even know about the character. And then um, I was chanting Brock, Brock Lesnar at WrestleMania 31. And then I feel and I felt like, and it's real, true real, I felt like something in my heart and I feel something like just changed just like that. I just I just felt in my heart like sorry for the guy. And that's why I became in a Roman Reigns fan, I became like a Roman Reigns guy and then I I, I do facts and I like do learning uh, learning about Roman Reigns but and his real name is Andy Joseph Anarai the titles he's holding, the family's been with, and then it's like it's incredible, and then for the darkest like for the darkest times, and and I will say Roman Reigns got me into the light. He is, and and, and I will and I will literally say I will fight my demons, and I, I will say this like. I just want to thank Roman Reigns to got me back to that track, back, uh, back me like to my life, where and 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 I and I will say people, I will pray and hopes for them when in the hospital when I had leukemia. I'll pray and hope hopes for them. Me, mine's is a different story. I'm not got leukemia. I'm not got it at all, but. Me and mine is a different story where it's, it's kind of where I have, my life is a bit like good and bad times where I had people, it's been a lot, I, 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 there's a lot of people and I can't explain this but I have been a lot of people, a lot of people who bully in, in my life. Um, I had like confusion and trouble and like like well not trouble like when people used to call me names and bullying and such and such and that and then I I I I felt something was missing. I felt in in my heart and I thought like ah something's missing something. It's missing, but it's like, it's like now the man I look up to now is Leader Joseph, Leader Joseph Anarai, aka Roman Reigns. This guy, I'm always supporting him, always, always have, always well because this guy got me back on track into my life. Because, like, where, like, I had so many good times in my life and, it's, like, just, like, i got a girlfriend uh, out there in the world. Um, i got a good family. And it's, to me, it's all, it's all thanks to one guy, one actor, one hero I look up to. And then every time he said, I, I feel touched, every word... He, in now I was cried. I I'm I'm trying to keep all that, those tears keeping it in. But to me, the bottom of my heart, I always, always respect 
as the guy. Not the character, I will always respect the guy. Because to me, I I will never forget making this video for you. Like, part announcer, I will literally, I will praise and hopes uh, people who had leukemia, I will pray and hopes them to beat leukemia. What the Marines did. And that's why, to me, I always respect when people had it and I, I'm quite sorry for him and I really do I will pray and hope for him so if it's a kid I will pray pray for the hopes for the kid and so is the adults and teenagers what they're going through if people who had cancer right and I'll praise and hopes for them it's like what women rain said it's very touching and it's like deep down the bottom bottom of my heart and it's feel and it feels real and it's to me that's feel re re like real system. I'm always been a fan of the the literally guy for years now. Till till in the, till in the future, I will always be a fan of of this guy because. I'm trying to keep it in so, so badly. I'm trying to keep it in so, so much. And I'm, and I'm glad the Roman Reigns is back. And I will literally have to say to Roman, I will say thank you. Thank you for changing my life for all these years. And on what he says, like, he's always entertained me. And that's why... I have I I started YouTube. I start of YouTube, and my goal is to send a message to Roman. I will keep supporting my. I will keep do what I do on YouTube. Keep supporting every week and every day, and do what I had to do and support Roman. Into in like into two thousand and fifteen. Into. Till the, the day, because no matter what, I'm always going to be a fan of Roman. Always have, always will. Because I, I feel my heart is literally just. I have no words for it. I, I feel like, like, touched. I, I feel, I feel like, like I feel like a, like a tingle. I feel like like a little sensor in my heart, and to me, it's a very touching moment. Very when that's why I can't put a video on here. That's why I let you guys listen to it because this is this is very very touching. That's why I don't want to cry and tear up. I know I just want to be strong. I just want to be strong because I know because he I, I bet he's watching right now I bet he, he don't want me to cry um, <laughs> um, that's why I'm, I'm gonna keep doing on YouTube till forever and ever for for my fans for my subscribers um, because I want this channel to grow big and I want this channel to grow and to send the whole world to message and say, like, how this guy, this uh, modern Ryan Empire, support Roman Reigns, and it's just incredible. And, it's just like, and that's why, to me, I, w I, I, will I, w I will literally have to say, I will say thank you to Roman. Because no matter what, I will I will literally do anything for support him. Because I I I to me I never booed him in every year over a decade. I never booed at him. 
and I've never booted them in years, but I think this is making a longer video. Um, I think to me, I, I. You know, and I know it, because I gotta go, I've got things to do, the big dog has got things to do. Um, if you like this video, please put your comments down below. If you like my reaction of the Roman Reigns, um, his story about up, uh, his, uh, uh, when, he, um, when he had uh, leukemia till uh, a few months in October, and then he, when he came back now, and it's on WWE Network. Go and subscribe to WWE Network. If you like, comment, and subscribe, because, you know, I'm going to have a nice lay-in. Because, you know, <laughs> I very, very touched what Women Rain said. I had it, because I don't want to cry. Because you know, I would head off out because I would see you guys later because the big dog would check you guys later because my yard, our yard, sorry, our yard, believe that because you know, hit that subscribe, hit that like button. I will check you guys later because my, I will check you in the next video on Smackdown Live. I will check you later because you know, you're the best, believe that.